Zucosis is a brand new horror game that came out two days ago and exploded in popularity but I really wanted to play the game and commentate on it but I have a 1050 so I'm stuck talking about the game which is fine I guess. What is Zucosis even about? You're a zookeeper who is on the brink of poverty and he needs this job really bad to feed his family so you got a sketchy job working at a zoo which you sign an NDA and you get a weird flu shot. At first I thought you were getting paid six bucks an hour but then it turns out you're making six figures overnight to take care of some animals, kangaroos, zebras, giraffes, but your wife is also worried of what you're doing and they keep you locked in the zoo until they unlock it in the morning. And the old zookeeper teaches you everything you need to know before you set out alone. How to feed the animals, how to order food, how to use the equipment, provide for the animals. Now at the beginning of the game it's very very slow, okay? It's like very very slow. Like the slowest beginnings in any horror game I've ever seen. I guess it builds up the momentum, you're gonna get scared and you get personal with the animals get to know them their names and their personalities now the game doesn't scare you right away it builds up to that point but like i said it's very slow which is fine i guess now the main monster in this game is a parasite which infects the animals in the enclosures and then it becomes a Dark Souls boss fight to get these parasites out. Now this is also the bad part of the game, which has a lot of bad, but also good, you will see later in the video. Zucosis is a very unique horror game which has a unique premise to horror. I mean who would imagine a zoo horror game and work so well? Well at least the premise worked so well. Now I read some Steam reviews and the game has mixed reviews. Now I thought I had performance issues even though I have an RTX 1050 but then I read some reviews and I wasn't the only one. The game itself has self-performance issues as well. The game is repetitive and it's very slow to the horror part of the game and I thought the game would be much fast paced but it's very slow. Even though you gotta fight the big boys once in a while you get one shot buddy and you better make it count because you get one dart and one gun. There is no semi-automatic or fully automatic on that gun that's a dart gun so you better make it count. Now the game generally has bad audio and lip sync issues and sound coming from places which does scare you or that's just me. It's probably me. Even the tutorial doesn't teach you how to use all the equipment on the cart which you gotta figure out on your own. Like bro, can you spend five more minutes just explain some tools to me before I become dinner? And the game becomes very repetitive very quickly. It kinda sucks. I made a YouTube short talking about the game and I thought every big streamer and YouTuber is gonna be playing this game but I guess not. This game seems like an unfinished game and for $25 really doesn't justify the price and this game could have been a lot more better if you ask me. Now the good, now there's some good in this game. 